Hi, everyone, and good afternoon. I'm Frank Malico. I'm Michelle Griego. The president woke up in San Francisco this morning, then made his way down the peninsula for more fundraising events. And we've got live team coverage of Mr. Obama's visit. Our Keiko Guerin is in Atherton, where the president is being met by protesters again today. But first, we go to Alyssa Harrington at Chrissy Field, where people were surprised to see the president board the helicopter this morning. And Alyssa, I guess this wasn't part of the original plan, right? This was not part of the original plan, and this is really one of the last places we expected to see the president during his visit. He woke up this morning in downtown San Francisco at his hotel, the Intercontinental, and then rather than head to the airport like he was supposed to, he came here to Chrissy Field. A big surprise for dog walkers and joggers getting their morning exercise in the marina. Police and Secret Service agents guarding Mason Road from the Yacht Club to Fort Point. Coast Guard boats near the Golden Gate Bridge, a line of five helicopters stationed at Chrissy Field. Pretty soon, the word was out. Just run in and saw the police cars, and they told us the president was here, and then we were shocked. President Barack Obama arrived in San Francisco yesterday on a tight schedule of fundraising events, but he was never supposed to come here. The plan was for the president to drive to SFO and fly in Marine One from SFO to his fundraisers in Atherton. But when plans changed, people here stopped and waited in the pouring rain, hoping to catch a glimpse of their commander in chief. I'd never seen him, so of course I hopped with the opportunity to see him. How long have you been out here? Um, probably for about an hour. How long are you willing to wait? Probably another 15 minutes. <laughs> Around 9.30, the motorcade rolled in. Here you see President Obama getting into his helicopter, and they're off. All five launched, soaring over a group of people watching from the sand. A thrill for Dave Anderson and his family visiting from Kentucky. This is the closest we've been to the president, and I don't think we'll get closer. So there's a chance we, he saw us waving, and I hope he didn't. Corinna Seid is an Obama supporter. If she had the chance to ask him one question. How did you enjoy San Francisco? Kind of see more the human side of him. And no real explanation why the president decided to make this detour, but one police officer told me he probably just wanted to avoid traffic, and who can blame him, right, Frank Michelle? Yeah, yeah. no kidding, especially in the Bay Area. All right, Alyssa, thank you. We should all be so thank lucky. You. Well, right now, the uh, president is hosting a luncheon in Atherton, where guests have paid up to uh, 1000 bucks a plate. Kate Kogarin continues our team coverage there. Hi, Kate.